For senior ball players in college hoops, the conference tournament is oftentimes their last ride. The fickle bounce of a ball can determine whether your career is over in the first round or you go out with that small piece of net tied to your championship ball cap. And for Johnson C. Smith, coming into the 2019 CIAA tournament as the last seed, most people outside of their locker room assume their last ride would be a short one. But for senior Roddick Rock Ross, that seeding meant nothing, as he knew no matter what number was next to his team's name, every game could very well be the last one of his career. And JCSU played the first two games of the tournament with nothing to lose. Ross beat Chawan on a game-winning buzzer beater on the opening night of the tourney, then turned around and dropped a team-high 25 points and another overtime win to advance the Golden Bulls to the quarterfinals in the Spectrum Center where the reigning CIAA champion Virginia Union Panthers were waiting to end the Golden Bulls' Cinderella run. But Roddick Ross was going to make sure that if this was indeed his last ride, he was riding the wheels off and leaving no gas in the tank. Rock got things started with a nice throwdown. But Virginia Union came out the blocks hot and showed why they were the reigning champs. The Panthers went on a 9-2 run to open the game, then followed that up with an 11-2 run later in the half. But Rock did his best to keep Smith in the game, shooting six for 10 from the field, including some big dog pit bull buckets in the paint. Ross had 13 first half points, but his team trailed 39-25 at the break. But coming out of the locker room, Rock Ross balled out like he knew no matter the final score, he was about to leave his heart and soul on the spectrum center floor and not by shooting a bunch of desperation threes or forced drives to the bucket. Nah, Rock Ross reached deep down in his bag and played some of the most inspired basketball we'd seen all season long. Rock was finishing strong at the rim. He found teammates on the wing for three. He got steals. tiptoed the out-of-bounds line, then pulled up for three. And in what felt like five seconds, he had brought his squad back to within five points in a game that seemed over at halftime. But the Rock Ross show was far from over. He had another big assist, followed by a huge three, followed by an incredible ISO pull-up J from the free throw line, and Johnson C. Smith was only down two. Then after another big assist from Rock Ross, the Golden Bulls had tied the game up, and it looked like Smith's Cinderella run might just roll into the semifinals. But Cinderella's carriage would indeed turn back into a pumpkin as the Panthers made some big plays down the stretch and took home the 79-71 victory, ending Johnson C. Smith's season and Roddick Rock Ross's college basketball career. But his last ride was one to be proud of. 39 points, 4 rebounds, 3 assists, and 0 reasons to hang his head in defeat. Because when you go out having given your all on a basketball court, you don't need a piece of net to prove you're a champion.